S-O-B-E-R Sober Steve says in the beer so you don't need to. Okay, we're going to do something a little bit outside the box now. <laughs> this is going to be a dessert. All right. Weird thing is, there's not really a lot of alcohol and there's no coffee in it. But I was just playing about and thought I'd try this one and uh, it worked quite well. So bear with me. What are you going to need? Arachino for eating some milk. About 40 ml. Okay. We'll put that in there now. I'll get that on the go. Well, I'll show you the rest of the ingredients. Some jam, okay? Cherry jam, this is uh, fruits of the forest, dark fruits. I'm gonna put in a bit of Kahlua, okay? Coffee liqueur, chocolate, blueberries for taste. Okay, let's get cracking. First of all, we're gonna put a little bit of our jam in the bottom of the glass, okay? This is just, you know, if you're stuck for a dessert idea one day, make quite a nice change. Okay, on top of the jam, we wanna put some chocolate powder. Okay, do this to your own taste, if you like hot chocolate. Okay, I'll put a couple of bits of them in, I think. Okay, milk's ready. We'll take this out and put the hot milk straight on top. What you'll find with the arachino, if you use a spring attachment as well, you'll get a nice little froth, okay. We'll save that froth and we'll just put in just a touch of glue just to give it a hint of coffee and then uh, to give us a bit of alcohol. Okay, looking good. We're missing one little thing, and that one little thing is cream. If you've got whipping cream, better. Just put a bit of cream on top. I've just sweetened this cream up a little bit. Whoa. <laughs> And then if you want, you can add a little decoration with a couple of fruits of your choice uh, using blueberries. Okay. And there we go, a little dessert coffee. You can either have it as it is, or give a little stir and taste it all in. Cheers. Nice, very nice.